What is going on? Welcome to Aged and Barreled. In recognition of the new Game of Thrones spinoff, House of the Dragon, today we're going to be taking a look at Johnny Walker's A Song of Ice. This is one of three limited edition Johnny Walker promotional whiskeys, the others being A Song of Fire and White Walker. This too has no age statement. It clocks in at 40.2 ABV or 80.4 proof. Um, I picked this up on sale. I was able to find this for around $13, but I believe regular retail is around $30. Just like the other two limited edition bottles, this sports a very cool wrap. This one has a albino dire wolf, possibly a Jon Snow's wolf ghost. Another cool little nod to Game of Thrones is the Striding Man turned Night King. This boasts notes of a crisp, clean taste. This blend's delicate flavor is green and grassy with notes of vanilla and tropical fruit. This blended scotch whiskey is best enjoyed over ice for a cold, smooth finish. So let's jump in and give it a try. The nose is slightly metallic and reminds me a little bit of like a nail polish remover. A little bit of nutmeg, a ton of vanilla, some sugar cane. It's like sweet vegetal, cooked celery. It's kind of like a sweet gin. The taste is kind of underwhelming. This does have a low alcohol percentage. The problem is that the lack of strong flavors around it, they're so subdued and they give too much space for this alcohol presence to dominate. On the tongue, I get notes of vanilla, cinnamon, honey, a very mild black pepper, and it is very grassy. Okay, on to the scoring section. Starting off with flavors, it's grassy with notes of vanilla bean, cinnamon, honey, and mild black pepper. The strength is 40.2%. The bite is low to medium. The complexity is also low to medium, and the price is around $30. Contrary to the wild and ferocious direwolf plastered upon the bottle, this whiskey is quite docile. More akin to a domesticated pup than a vicious wolf. Overall, the flavors are not unpleasant and fairly similar to how I recall Johnny Walker's White Walker tasting. The vanilla, cinnamon, and honey notes all go well together. This whiskey's main flaw is it aimed to be delicate, but came out weak instead. Unfortunately, this wolf's bark exceeds its bite. I'm giving Johnny Walker's A Song of Ice a 4.9 out of 10. All right, that is going to wrap up this video. If you've had Johnny Walker's A Song of Ice before, rate it in the comments below. Or if you're interested, pick up a bottle and let me know what you think. Thank you so much for watching, and as always, enjoy.